Yeah, and my cousin Mark. Wow, she's very prepared for me. Let's go and Josh. Now, uh, before we started the show, Marina did this little trick with her eyes that just totally gave me the willies. So get a real close up shot of Marina's face. Check this out. Go ahead and do it. Oh, oh, man, it gives me the willies every time. <laughs> Mark, how you doing? I'm doing good. You ready to play? Yes, yeah. Good man. George, you know, I'm going to pop over here to introduce George and these guys. Do these guys right here have the same barber? Look at this. They got a cold buzz cut. All right, Jordan, what are you doing in your free time, bud? Sports football. Favorite uh, football player? Dick Butchick. Dick Butchick? Were you even alive when you played? No. No? Okay, I'm just checking. Jordan, introduce your partner. This is my cousin, Daniel. Daniel, is this your favorite cousin? No. You sure? I guess. Good, I hope you guys work together, all right? Here we go, Lauren, how you doing? Fine. And what do you do in your spare time? I like to ride horses and act and things. Great, introduce your partner. This is Hayden, my Hi. best friend. Hayden, are you ready to play? Yes, sir. Good, let's give it up for our players. Yeah! They're ready because they know this is the show that can make them a master. It's called Masters of the Maze. Check it out, yeah! to wait over there, take off that way. Hopefully we'll see them later. Right now I've got my three main players right here. They're dressed in their power suits, ready to go. Are you guys ready to go? Yeah. yeah. Good, here's what it's going to take, okay? Over here, we've got pictures. Every time a picture comes up and they get it right, we're going to give them 10 points. Then we're going to ask them a question about that picture. If they get that right, we'll give them another five points. First two players to make it to 50 points. That's the big. 5-0 are going to find themselves inside the video game of the future, which is very awesome, okay? Hands on buzzers. We'll go into our first picture. Everybody at home, try to beat them out. Here we go. What do you see? Marina, what do you see? A vacuum cleaner. A vacuum cleaner is right for 10 points. Good job, Marina. Are your eyes okay? Yeah. All right, just checking. Here's your question. Which of our presidents shares his name with a popular brand of vacuum cleaners? Hoover. Hoover? She doesn't even need my help. <laughs> Hoover, you weren't even alive when Hoover was president. No, you guys know a lot about your history. Way to go. All right, here comes our next picture. Take a look. For 10 points, Jordan, what do you see? Buttons. Buttons is right. Good job. Get some good eyes there, pal. Here comes your question. Now, buttons are fasteners, right? Yes. I want you to spell fastener for me. F-A-S-T-E-N-R. Oh, almost, almost. It was N-E-R. You knew what it was, though. We'll let you keep the 10 points. Here we go to our next picture. Who do you see for 10, Lauren? Robin Williams. That's right. That puts you on the board. The word, Lauren. Here's your question. In what popular TV show did Robin Williams play an alien from the planet Orc? Was it Lost in Space, Battlestar Galactica, or Mork and Mindy? Um, Mork and Mindy. Mork and Mindy is right. Mork from Mork. We're going to our next picture. For 10, Jordan. Piano. Piano is the right way to go. Don't worry, I will not ask you to spell fastener. Here's your question. How many keys are there on a standard piano? 52, 88, or 105? 52. No, it's 88. I didn't know that one either, but uh, fortunately I had the answers in front of me. Here comes the next picture. Take a look. What do you see for 10, Lauren? A cow. A cow is right. Good job. Here comes the question in the Old West. What did they call those crooked guys who stole cows? Ramrods, rubies, or rustlers? Rustlers. Rustlers. They were rustlers. Good work. All right, next picture is coming your way. Check it out. What do you see? A geyser. Marina, a geyser is right. Nice job. Just speed out the buzzer. Here comes the question. The geyser called Old Faithful erupts from the depths of what national park? Yellowstone, Yosemite, or Zion? Yosemite. No, it's Yellowstone. It's Yellowstone. That's all right. Good job. Here we go. Next picture. Marina, what do you see? A computer? No, computer's not right. Jordan, Lauren, hands on buzzers. Here's more of the picture. Jordan for 10. TV? TV is right. Good job, pal. Jordan is a good name. Here comes your question. Which of these is a type of TV antenna? Cattails, rabbit ears, or frog legs? Cattails. 
No, they call them rabbit ears. Rabbit ears. All right, we're going to our next picture. Take a look. What do you see for 10, Marina? A vase? Yes, that's right. Good job she wasn't sure, but she got it. Here comes your question. When an artist paints a picture of flowers in a vase, what is it called? A still life, a self-portrait, or a cubicle? A still life? Still life is right. Another guess, I think. But you got it right. We'll give you the points. Here comes the next picture. What do you see? Jordan for 10. A uh, X-Men. A cartoon. No, no, I need more specific than that. Marina, Lauren, hands on buzzer. Here comes more of the picture. Marina. Stormy? Stormy or Storm is right for the game. Way to go, Marina. Do you want to go first or second into the maze? Second. She's going to go second right now. She's going to get decked out in her power suit. Head off that way. Give it up for Marina. Go ahead, Marina. All right, guys. Now we're going into speed round. we got a score of 30 to 30 right now. Next team to make it to 50 is going to find themselves inside the maze, okay? Pictures are still worth 10. Only this time there's no question. All right. Here we go. First picture. Take a look. Check it out. Jordan, what do you see for 10? Man parachuting. You got it. That's right. One more picture, Jordan, and you're on your way. Here we go. Hands on buzzers. Next picture. Oh, this will keep you in the game, Lauren. What do you see? An ambulance. An ambulance is right. Way to go. All right, here we go. We got one more picture left. Whoever gets it right is going into the maze. Here's your picture. For the game, Lauren, what do you see? A bone? A bone is right. Nice job. Jordan, give me a high five, Lauren. We're so glad to have you here. I hope you had a good time. When we come back, we are going into the maze for the run from the future. Stay with us. We'll be right back.